no one has any opinions on whether or not we need to use the layers or the bricks. Well, it doesn't matter, because right now we're going to be using cobblestone, uh, the big tiles, for our expansion goals. I'm kind of torn between knowing I need to build, like, a, a mob sort of slaughter situation, where we can kill a bunch of monsters and get their goods. We need to expand our, our animal breeding operations over there. But then at the same time, it's like, yeah, but I, I need to keep an eye on the bees. No, they, they don't, don't escape. Come here, you. What are you. Where are you at right now? Are you about ready to, uh, let's shut that. About ready to breed again? Yeah, you're about ready. Oh, but your friend's gone inside now, haven't they? Hold on. They're being stubborn. We need to pick a different tune. Um, there you go. It's all about just finding the right tune. Did too much time pass? No, good. I was, I was a little bit worried that there might be some sort of a limiter on that. All right. He's having a party right now. Oh my gosh, the pollination has gone crazy on this one. So we'll let those other two grow up. We'll breed them together to make a different kind as well here in a minute. But for now, let's go ahead and we will break the two of these. I'm excited. We can start making like iron tools. Oh, but we'll probably need to use... Well, no, it'll let me create vanilla weapons as well. I was going to say we, we could make a tinker's construct. Like one of those big tool melty things, but... If the game's not going to force me to, I'm certainly not going to, like, jump uh, head first into that. Give me some cobblestone here. Give me some cobblestone to work with. We want to turn all of this into cobblestone big tiles. Where's that at? Maybe some big tiles. Turn all of that into big tiles as well. It's way more useful to have these than it is to have vanilla cobblestone. So now I need to be able to expand all of this without the cows also, like, just walking over the edge and into oblivion. Maybe I should just go ahead and go around to the outside and expand. No, I don't actually- you know what? I don't actually care. If the cows walk off the world, the cows walk off the world. At this point, at this present moment, I couldn't care less about what happens to the cows. If they want to throw themselves off the edge of the world, I'm going to scream and shout and let it all out and be upset about it, but I'm not going to worry about it. So here we go. We're going to surround all of this, like so. And then I don't really know what we're going to do because I have not thought about it much after that. That's sort of the furthest I've gone. All of this wood is going to be replaced though with stone at some point. Or actually we'll replace all that wood on the inside. We'll replace it all with, with dirt. Also, yeah, I'm carrying a lot of really important things with me right now, like an absolute fool. On the, on the edge of the world, where at any point, one mistake, right? Like, if I ran and just started jumping and I ran off the edge here. Can you imagine? Just everything would be gone. I'd reckon that's when we quit the series. As soon as we die, we're done. This is a hardcore series now. It's not a hardcore map or anything like that, but that's the decision that's been made. So there we go. That's been extended out a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and let the sheep out, too. Because, bless them. They, they've been stuck in here with these gosh darn chickens for so long. I, I, they might even start to think they are chickens. That happens sometimes. Animal get, animals get confused like that really easily. Okay. So, you all stay inside of here for now. Thank you for the eggs. I appreciate it. I'm going to expand this out a bit more. So, let's actually go ahead and connect these. And instead of having these be two different areas, eventually this will all be one area. So that means expanding this out by two as well. Hi, cow. You've immediately decided to just go for... Go for the nonsense. I did not anticipate that being a thing that happened. Again, with the escape artistry. They knew what they were doing. They set out with a goal, and their goal was to get over there. Not because they needed to, not because they wanted to, but because they knew that was the thing they could do that would annoy me the most in life. And gosh darn it, good on them, actually. I'm, I'm almost impressed. Excuse me, get out of the way. Stay inside of there. Stay! Alright, I've already killed one chicken that we even named at one point. Now, unfortunately for you, there's a punishment to be incurred if you come into my territory, and that is that your flesh gets turned into a useful building material. You, they're not dumb enough to throw themselves off the edge, are they? I mean, I understand they're Minecraft animals. You can look in their face and you can kind of make that determination for yourself. I'm just sort of assuming that they're not that stupid, but they could very well be. Okay, let's take this delicious, delectable raw flesh and put it inside the fires to cook into something edible. Oh, 
let's see. I don't know. I thought maybe if I clicked on the top specifically, maybe it would be more likely to go into my inventory. And that does not appear to be the case. Although, of the ones we just did, I feel like most of them came into my inventory. Stay inside. Yes. The iron is sort of the most important right now, because that's the material we have the least of. So that's what we need to keep processing. Eventually, we will have electricity. I'll throw that out there, too. That's apparently something in this pack that you get to eventually, if, you, if, you're, if you're patient. Ten iron honeycomb. Nice. Okay. So this should give us ten pieces of iron. So we can breed the honeybees one more time. We'll have the maximum number for that hive. We can think about upgrading that hive. And then we'll have enough for... What did it say? Would it, would it hold ten bees? And then we can start breeding them to make other types of bees as well. Uh, did that did that run out of... Okay. I didn't anticipate that it wouldn't work just because we don't have glass bottles. I think that's a problem we ran into the last time we streamed this. But that does mean that at some point I'm going to have to start doing something. Like, we're going to have to start making a bunch of glass bottles. And then we're going to have to tr probably find a use for all of this honey that we have. Like, at the moment we only have five honey. But that's, that's going to become... I mean, you know what? We can make another one of these glass bottles and just have it constantly being filled up with honey if it has some sort of function. What, what am I doing right now? I think we're going to go be, uh, breed the bees one more time. To get our maximum number of, hey little guy, what if you didn't do what you're doing right now? Because my concern is that if you grow up and you're stuck up there, you'll get pushed somewhere or die. That's my concern right now about what you're doing. If you wouldn't mind just going back the way you came, I'll catch you if I need to. If that's the situation we're in. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Yeah, I don't know if I can catch you. You barely, like, register as a creature that exists at the moment. I think probably owing to your small size and your current position in the world. It will not let me catch. I'll come inside. Hold on. Let me just hop in here with your... Okay. Let me see if I can figure you out. Get a little... There we go. All right, little guy. There you go. Thank you. Okay. I need another bee to come out, please. Um... Oh, no, I need you both out, actually. I'm sorry, I, I didn't clarify. Come on out. One of the adults, please. It's going to be useless if it's a kid. I can't do anything with that. Thank you. There you are. No, you're the same one. We need a different song. It doesn't like that one. I'm... I, I should have not gone with like a, a young young song. I should have gone with like an oldie. I need to get one of the adults out here. What's an old song? Ugh, never mind. They just heard me mention the oldies and they got excited. Hello, hello, hello. This is like an escape. We got mother and we got we got daughter here. Get inside of there, thank you. Is that the whole family? You got siblings now? What do we got? We got one, two, three. Wait, four. Shouldn't we have one more? I thought we'd done this twice now. Oh. Yeah, that's how math works. No, we've done this thrice. There should be four bees inside of here. What am I missing? Did one get out? I mean, I see that there's another baby over here trying to do a lunatic thing. I'm gonna have to keep going on rescue missions for these darn things, aren't I? Stop it. Come here. I don't know why you're doing this. Just stay down here like a, like a good little baby. I found one. I found one. It's, again, doing the... It's doing the gosh darn twist up there. Is this what's happening to the babies? Is this, is this why I seem to be missing a bee? They keep doing this? And then presumably growing up and bad things happen? Bad things happen? There's two in there. There's three out here. All right, all the bees are present and accounted for. I think we need to replace those up there with like actual solid blocks. I think that's what we're going to go ahead and do. Oh, you know what we can do? Lucas, you'll love this. We'll go ahead and use these. We'll use these as the toppers. Unless it looks horrible. We could also probably chisel some wood. I don't know if you can make wooden whatever we said that these were before. But that could be an interesting look. That could be a fun design. Let's check and see. So we'll start with a plank. And then also though, can you do anything with an oak log? Let's find out. Okay, so plank. Ooh, okay. You got oak planks smooth. I like the look of that. That would be an interesting topper there. And then you can also, can you do an oak log? There's nothing you can do with an oak log. That's understandable. I like the look of the large planks. That looks really good. I like that. There's a lot of like crude paneling and things like that. And I, I don't know about that. You know, we're trying to keep like a, 
uh, a decent monetization rating on these. I don't know if I want to put a crude panel in the game. <laughs> oh, heavens. Okay. Plankage. Smoothage. We're not going to take a nap. I think the bees kind of chill a little bit at night. I might be misreading that situation. That was the vibe that I got. So I kind of want to like just leave them to be chill if that's what's going to happen. So we'll break that. Plop that there. Yeah, I like that. That looks good. Okay. I noticed the bees are kind of hovering around the, the extremities of the cage. Maybe they've realized what's happening. Maybe this was all a ploy from the beginning. This could have all been some sort of elaborate escape attempt on their part where they were like, hey, if we keep getting stuck up there, eventually he'll do something to like fix the problem. And while he... Oh my gosh, they're doing a Finding Nemo! They're doing a Finding Nemo! They're going to wait till I, I put them all in their little baggies and they're going to they're gonna roll out to sea. Except this time it's like, hey, if we just, if we just get up there, eventually we'll be able to get out. When he breaks the the wood to place down the replacement pieces, we just make a bust for it. But I'm, I'm too fast for them. I'm too quick. Except for this guy. I don't know. Now that I'm kind of looking at this, maybe it would have been better to just use the uh, use the bricks. But maybe I want to replace all the bricks with the stone planks smooth. You know? Who, who are you to tell me I can't as well? Alright, little B. Go back the way you came, please. You're so confused. This is the worst escape attempt I've ever seen. Absolutely inept. Maybe they just like me and they want more attention from me. That's also possible. That would explain some of their behavior. They were just like, let's let's goof off so dad pays attention to us. I'm making myself dad in their lives. You know, why not? Any of that? Gosh darn it. There's gotta be a better way. There we go. Okay, you all stay in there. We'll deal with the rest of this later. Right now, my primary issue is iron and just stockpiling of... Why are you all outside? I don't understand your behavior. I don't understand why you've made these decisions you've made. Cows. I don't know if I like them, Lucas. A fishy bees can give diamonds. Lucas, what? You built a smeltery, but you can't remember why. Oh. Uh, can we go back to that bit where you said fishy bees can give diamonds? I need to follow the logic there. Let's see, fishy. Because we have one. He's the most ridiculous looking little creature in the world. Uh, base health, 10. You know, attack, 10, 1. Has honeycomb, yes. Okay. If we right-click on him, what, if, what, what kind of information are we getting here? We, we know that... Are you saying that we need the fishy bee to breed with the water bee to make the sea bee? Is that what you're suggesting? Are you suggesting we need to do something with Fishy Honeycomb? If we run Fishy Honeycomb through a centrifuge... Oh my gosh, there's a 1% chance for diamonds! You're absolutely correct, and we're not doing anything with Fishy Honeycomb. We have so much of it. Just take it all out. We might as well just immediately process this. There's no reason not to. Toss it all in there. Now, the one issue we're going to have is we're going to run out of... Uh, we're going to run out of bottles. So let's go ahead and grab all of these... And we're going to empty all of these into here. I'll get another one for water later. Really? No? You're not going to let me? I mean, I know what I need to do, apparently. What we need to do is we need to get a bucket. Like an empty bucket. Or even a clay bucket is fine, too. Empty clay bucket. And then we can empty these into it. But that is such a remarkably inconvenient way of doing that, and you can only do them four at a time, but there we go. We got seven of those in there now. I don't think it gives honey every time, does it? Hold on, let me check uses again in the centrifuge. 25% chance, so one in four, and then this is one in 100. I'd say, you know what? There's a pretty good odds. Drink honey? What's drinking honey gonna do? Oh, get rid of it. <laughs> that, was that the idea, Gilliam? I mean, I'm not opposed to it. Let's process this for a hot minute, though, and see what we get. We're definitely going to have plenty of food, which is good. Minecraft has its own, like, culinary cookery thing now, doesn't it? Hold on. If we look at uses for salmon, there's smelting, but then there's also the smoker. Which, look, I've never been a big fan of smoking. It does a big, like, number on your lungs, but this could be fun. Oh, uh, we just get wood? Any kind of wood it looks like around a furnace. I'll give that a go. I'll give that a red hot go. We need a cobblestone. Well, we can get charcoal. Uh, I don't, never mind. I was gonna say we need a ch <laughs> we need a coal uh, bee, but no, we don't. This is thrilling gameplay design. I don't know if we're gonna get. I mean, even if we'd get a diamond, what am I gonna do with that? I don't know. There's only so much you can do with a diamond. We're definitely gonna have a lot of fish. 
40 raw salmon, five more honey. That's eight honey. So that's actually usable because now we can make two buckets of honey. Why not also start mechanism and get energy and make the centrifuge automatic? Right. Well, I mean, that is the goal eventually, isn't it? Well, we'll get there. That's the issue with packs like this. It's like, well, I, I could go in any number of directions, but what do I need to do first? And then you got to sort that out. So we have plenty of cobblestone. Looks like we had, or not cobblestone, sorry. We have plenty of, uh, whatever that stuff is, charcoal. Looked like we had charcoal making charcoal, which to quote, you know, the great C-3PO, that's, that's kind of perverse. Do we have any more logs around here? We do. Or, because I'm not sure looking at that recipe whether or not it, we were intended to put, you know what, we can just click on here and like, yeah, it's logs. You put logs around it. Okay. I'm pretty sure this is vanilla Minecraft. There you go. Got your smoker. We're going to put in no more cooking things over an open flame. Raw salmon, bit of charcoal. Let's see how many of these that cooks up, because I don't know. It could also be faster. It looks like it's faster than a furnace for cooking food. And it might be more efficient. I'm unsure. What I do know is that num num num. Mmm, delicious. Okay, back inside of here we go, because I'm sure we're ready to get some more. Oh, almost. No, wait, no, not at all. Oh, right, it's nighttime. Right, you're ready to go. We are going to go ahead and update one of the beehives. I, I don't know, should we do that? Should we focus on, like, maybe getting more bees first before we focus on upgrades? That- probably so. Oh, also, I- I kind of stopped in the middle of- of redecorating all of the beehives. I'm not too worried about it right now. Even though it definitely looks like we might have lost a cobblestone bee. Probably to the same method, because, like... There's already three in here. There's already two in here, yeah. I think the babies have all been lost, probably to getting stuck up there and then growing up and dying. But we're not around to protect them. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and address that right now so that we don't have that problem anymore. Uh, we are going to need more going to need more wood though is the only issue. Whatever we didn't we didn't replant the tree here. Like absolute fools and frauds. We completely neglected to do that. I think running around it is the fastest method. There we go. So while it's nighttime, and while I have theorized without actually knowing or really verifying in any way that bees are less active at night, we'll take that opportunity to go ahead and take down... Can we, like, one-shot this? I think we probably could. That's gonna do all of it. Yeah, that's what we want to do. Take it all down. Beautiful. And then we just kind of got to get this sealed up before the big ones wake up as the sun is rising and realize that they can make a break for it. Now we just need to prevent them from sort of crossing over into each other's nests, because that could also be problematic. They're not going to give me what I what I actually want them to if they can get into each other's nests. And we're going to run out here. No, no, there's only one left. One, two, three. Perfect. There we go. So now I think we could probably start breeding them, debreeding them again. And, oh gosh, the whole family came out that morning. Did you see that? That was crazy. Good on them. Okay, now let's get to breeding. Let's get to breeding. Do you reckon that they'll take the, like, modified cobblestone? Do you think they'll be bothered by the fact that it's no longer, like, just a vanilla cobblestone? Yeah, they are. They don't like it. They don't want that. I could just go grab more cobblestone, but you know what? We're gonna go ahead and just turn these two back into vanilla cobblestone, because I don't need them right now. And they're taking up inventory space. Excuse me, everybody, calm down here. There you go. They can be babies. Appreciate it. I don't have any wood to spare. I'll have to go fetch some more of that. I see that you're ready to go. This is the issue with this, is you get distracted with like, busy work. You're trying to progress the plot along, but then what ends up happening is you're like, oh, oh, we can do this, we can do this. Oh, hold on, I gotta go process some bee stuff. I'll be right back. Because there's a possibility we might be getting something good out of this, so if you'll just be patient with me. We'll get some more of this. So how did that do? It cooked up uh, it cooked up eight of them. Remember, we took one out earlier. So it's pretty much, it, it's the exact same in terms of, of how much it produces. Uh, it's just faster for cooking up salmon. Also, that why is why do I have more raw salmon? I thought I put it in there. I, it doesn't matter. Eat the raw salmon. Eat the cooked salmon. Eat the salmon at all. Do something. What, what did I come out here for? Cobblestone? I probably came out here for cobblestone. Nope, wood. It was wood. I came out here for wood. Got two pieces of wood. And we could have just used that wood earlier too, now I'm realizing. We we did not have to uh, cut down another tree. There we go. 
So now they shouldn't be able to get out and kill themselves, so that's good. Or get themselves killed by trying to get out. They probably don't need this much space. We've given them a lot more space than they need. We could probably shrink this down quite a bit. And... I mean, the real issue is getting stuff out of here, but I'm not too pressed. Is this ready to go? This is ready to go. So I think the next thing we need to do is we need to breed the next type of bee. I'm making that decision right now. Uh, before we do anything else, we're going to go ahead and do that. So we need one piece of iron, and we need one piece of regular old vanilla cobblestone. Which means that this cobblestone brick is getting turned back into that. 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 We're going to go ahead and get this out of here as well. I'm going to, I'm going to do this in sort of the open here in the middle. Who's ready to breed? You. No! No! Stop! Stop! Was it just one? Did just one get out? Why did you go over there? Uh, get out of that hive right now! We'll have to wait. Well, I just have to wait, I guess. I gotta figure out, did, did more than one get out of here? There's one bee in there, and it looks like there's... a little baby bee there, and a big bee there, and there's one out. So it's one, two, three, four. The One of them's in here. Oh, and then there's one flying above. I guess I didn't notice. Right? Hold on. No. I'm so deeply confused. I definitely feel like... The oh, there's one in my inventory. There we go. Okay. Come here. <laughs> also, you come here. Okay? The two of you... We should have built, like, a breeding room for them where they don't have access to other hives. Gold! We also need gold, you're right. What goes into that? That's where we're going. So we've got to get nickel to copper to gold. It's all coming together. Okay. We're gonna have to do this, like, rapidly. Oop. 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 Are you not ready to breed? You're not a breedable one. Then consider that. Are you a breedable one? You're not ready to breed either. Are you the one I just put back in here? Which one are you? You're ready to breed. There you go. Go find the iron bees around here somewhere. There you go. Beautiful, lovey-dovey, matey dance. Love that. Thank you. Thank you. And then what did you produce? What are you? Are you are you are you nickel or whatever? Proper, proper game mechanics there, isn't it? Alright. Iron B. Go home. Stay with your family. You also... Stop it. Stop it. Stay inside. Okay, we've got a nickel B. Not to be confused with a nickel back, although I think we already made that joke. And also, it's not really a joke, it's just a dumb thing I've said. So I guess coming off of this one, what we need to do is we need to have a fence, fence... So, gates right here. Definitely gonna need some more of these blocks, because I do not have enough on me right now. Eventually, we're gonna push this way, and we're gonna get this guy caught in properly. He's been living this life sort of outside of the system, where he's- I think he's probably started to feel a little bit like he can get away with anything. Wait a minute, hold on. Spice rack? That's fun. I, I mean, I don't have any spices, but what can I spore on that? Like ginger spice and all things nice? We should probably do a better job moving forward of organization. Because I don't know where anything is, and things are all mixed up around here. Toss all of that back in there. There we go. There's probably more sticks around than what I'm seeing. There's definitely more fences. Hold on just a second. There's a ton of fences. I don't need to make any of these. We'll just take out stacks of them. Stacks of wood as well, just in case. So let's go ahead and frame this thing up first, is what we're gonna do. So we got one, two, three, and then... There we go. So you'll note, so far, the complete and total lack of the game crashing throughout this entire endeavor. Isn't that, isn't that just lovely? How much fun is that? We have way too much stuff in our inventory. Um... What can we do? What can we do? Let's 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 throw this big blocks in here. We'll throw all of these in here. Everything on this row is getting thrown in here. We'll probably end up needing it here in a minute, and I'll regret that decision. But for right now, at least I've got some breathing room in here. So we will get. I would actually like 32 of those. 
half stack. Well, you know what? We'll do a whole stack because we're going to end up using some more of this stuff anyway. And I think that also, like, we're halfway through the endurance on our planks, or on our chisel. So it, we're going to lose that thing. We need to stop wasting it on, like... I don't know if, if it's determined by operations or number of blocks that you can do. In which case, doing big operations versus many smaller ones might end up being kind of the same thing. I, I am unsure at this moment. Uh, we're going to need a hive. We're going to need another campfire. All things that we know how to do. Please don't. I'm worried he's gonna, he's not going to go anywhere. He's fine. He's trusty. We've had that bee for a long time, and he's caused us literally no problems. So I'm not bothered by him at all. I think I of all the bees that we have, that is the bee that I trust. So what am I missing for this? We need to have some logs, some sticks, and a torch. Literally only missing a torch. And surprisingly, it doesn't look like we have any of those, but I can make some. Okay. And then the beehive is going to require... Honeycomb and planks. We have plenty of honeycomb. I think I tossed it all inside of here in anger and frustration. But neither of those words are actually accurate to how I felt. That's a little bit of an exaggeration. Lovely. And then what do we need to upgrade it to the next tier? Just grass? We have tons of that, don't we? Didn't we determine there was a bunch of it inside of this chest here that we weren't using? Yeah. I think we harvested extra last time. So it's actually good that we still had that because that gave us the opportunity to... Uh, use it right now instead of having to go harvest some more you still you still around here buddy you didn't make your great escape at the bottom told you i could trust him and then what direction do we need to like shift click to place this thing exactly like that perfect finally we need some gates and we'll be ready to let this little bee free although oh look there's there's four of them right here there's four beehives look at that What can you do? Such is life, I suppose. Such is life. Gates! Do we have any? Not like Bill Gates. I want the actual gates. There we go. Useful gates. Which is not something that Bill's ever been called. Hey, oh, all right. Lovely. Now, you can be free and you can start to grow up and I need to get you some nectar. So let's go and see what goes into this guy's nectar. We can just left click on him and see. He really wants a copper bee nectar. Wait, that's not a copper bee. No, we've made a nickel bee. And he wants nickel bee nectar, which is going to be a combination of cobblestone and honey. So I need to stop turning the honey bee nectar into iron and focus for at least a bit on making some nectar for this guy. Did I get all of it? I think I got all of it that time. That's great. I'd like to see that. And we also need some more cobble. We probably have enough cobblestone bee nectar already so that it's not going to be a problem. The issue is some of it does go inside here and I, do, I don't want to leave any behind because that's going to be the little bit that makes the difference, you know, 12 hours into the game. The vanilla, I'm not so sure about... Now, wait just a minute. Did I do this, or did you just, like, figure that out at some point? I don't, I don't know if that's my fault or not. Also, wait, what are you? Hold on. You're not right either. I am so... De oh, the babies! The babies didn't die! They didn't die! They just got out and went to the next-door neighbors! The lunatics! I thought they'd all just, like, exploded in the ceiling when they became grown-ups, but that's not what happened at all! That's great. That, that's a warm your heart kind of story right there. That really brings a smile to my aged face. It makes me feel a little bit of joy for the first time in a thousand years. What what are you? Are you sand honeycomb? I need this. Did it mention how many it needed, by the way? It did. I wasn't paying enough attention. Hold on. Two of each. Again. Okay. Well, like I said, we ooh, we, we, we actually are not even close to what we need there we've got four of these and we've got five no we've got six of the iron so we'll put the rest of them away hold on didn't we have some we shoved inside of here earlier yeah we got a bit more of the iron okay all right we're good on the iron we're definitely good on the iron it's just the cobblestone we're waiting for no 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 no, no. we're good on the cobblestone too perfect okay there we go iron honeycomb and We're still down. 
but it's not going to take as long as I thought it would because we do have, a, well, I mean, with two, that's not super helpful. So maybe it is going to take a while longer. But that's fine. Store all those inside of there. It's, it's becoming a little bit of a mess, but that's okay. We'll have just the wood be everywhere, and, and I'm not bothered by it. We can go ahead with the fish honeycomb, though, and have another shot at maybe getting diamonds. And then, of course, the number one like goal for me right now when it comes to getting the diamonds is utilizing them in the most helpful way I can imagine. Like, for example, making a diamond chisel, which will have a much better life than... <laughs> You think this is a bit, don't you? This isn't a bit. I'm serious. That's that's what I want. I want a diamond chisel. It'll last longer. We're also going to probably end up using some iron for an iron shears once these break. Uh, let's see. Get a backpack. That's an idea. Let's see. Backpack. What are our options? Only need iron. Okay, we've got a couple of different ones here. We have the infinity backpack, which I feel like maybe we're a little bit far away from. So probably not that one. A piggy backpack, which I guess goes on a pig. That's a fun concept. And then finally, we have the white backpack, which is going to require wool, a chest, and some iron. We can definitely do that right now. We have plenty of sheep that we can go shear. I think this might be the end of our shears here, though, if I had to guess. Yep, there they go. Uh, time to upgrade to some better shears and also throw one of our long-standing tools just on the ground for no real reason entirely accidental. I feel like we've lost some animals over the edge. I've not heard them go, but I'm pretty sure they're gone. That's all right. Life carries on. So do we. Chests. Backpack. Look at that! All right! And that was a quest, apparently. I've not been paying enough attention to the quests. I've been so distracted with my own machinations. Was that in the start? Where's that at? Storage, probably? Yeah, look at that. Nice, okay. So how does this thing work? Do I just right-click on it and we have a backpack? We do. That's exactly how it works. Nice, all right. We'll keep that over here next to the handheld crafting table. And what we can do is we can keep sort of our, like, our honey things inside of it. Maybe not the, the best for long-term. I think long-term we'll definitely want a different solution for this. But for right now, in this exact moment, just kind of oh wait no hold on come back out of there right now in this exact moment this is exactly where i want all of my honey stuff is right on my person that's going to come in super handy all right let's head back inside and we'll check on the bees remember we're just waiting on iron bee nectar now and we should probably go to bed if we want to make that happen again i'm, I'm starting to lean into that theory maybe there's something to it that it, the bees like the night Ooh. was that the sound of bees creating honey or the sound of bees going back into their hives I don't know why, but I like these shears so much more. I feel so much more confident just wielding them. <laughs> they made a break for it, didn't they? Bless their souls, they made a break for it right as I was going out. Breed another nickel. We could breed another one. Yeah, we probably should as well. But for right now, let's focus on getting its uh, thingy up and going. Oh, wow. Okay, so... With that five, we have seven. We're, we're so close now. Maybe we will go ahead and just breathe and breed another one. Uh, we have the iron and we have the cobblestone. Let's clear out this all down here. And get ready to grab... Oh gosh, you can't actually grab them until you walk through the door. Okay. I'm always convinced one came out with me. Hello? Hello? Hi. <laughs> Sorry, I almost aided and abetted your escape attempt. Uh, definitely not intentional. So, we need that to capture the baby. And then we need to immediately feed the adults as soon as they're out. Okay, so. Cobblestone. Boop. Iron. Boop. 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 Boop, baby. Probably should have done two to begin with, now that I think about it. So they would both grow up at the same time and could both be bred at the same time. And I did not consider that at the moment. Or in the moment. So that's not great on us. But there we go. I was way too distracted with making sure it got food. Which will tell you where my headspace is. I'm looking forward to having the thing that we can get through that they cannot. What was it called again? I know that's one of the things, the mob filter. I'm looking forward to this. This is going to be one of the coolest things we build. Just waiting for copper. 
uh, and then bronze. Or, I'm sorry, gold. And then we can finally build ourselves a golden pickaxe, combine it with uh, andesite, diorite, granite, stone, some regular old gates, and then we'll have our mob filters, the lost players to walk through. Life is going to be so much easier once we Life could be a dream when we have the mob filter up above. And it's the only way that we can get through. Life will be a dream, dooby doo. And now we are waiting once again. Just waiting patiently. Oh, there we go. Didn't need to wait that long. Is that all of it? Hmm. I definitely felt like I saw it zoom sideways, but there we go. So that is finally enough to get our iron honeycomb. And we will get the two of those. We're going to need probably also honey for this, but we do have a few buckets of honey ready to go over here. So hopefully it'll just work. And what we're looking for is the nickel... This one? Envar. Nickel B nectar block. Is that correct? Iron and cobblestone. Go for it. Beautiful. While that's running... We'll take this opportunity to process... Oh, I don't have any more, really? Hold on. Let's get the sand out here as well. We're going to go ahead and get all of these out. There we go. Like I said, this is not going to be the best in the long run. But for right now, I want to have all these available to me at a moment's notice. Yeah, that's what I wanted. I was going to say, while we wait on those fellas to grow up and for that to get finished, we can go ahead and take this opportunity. Oh, jeez. I don't want to keep... I don't want to keep harvesting right now. I would use this opportunity to maybe get a diamond. This could be it. Statistically speaking, it won't be. But eventually, also statistically speaking, we will open this up and have a diamond. Someday. Just not today, which is a shame. How long does that take? D -d Did it say? 60 seconds. I guess that's universal for anything processing at the low temperature. And then at the high temperature, it's also 60 seconds. Okay. Well, whatever. I prefer not to look at it as a minute of my life passing me by that I'll never get back, because that's a depressing way to look at pretty much everything in life. Hey, fellas, like, I brought you something. You know what? Hold on. Are they both inside of there? One of them is. One of them got out. That's okay. We're actually going to go ahead and do that in this one. There, I think... Uh, okay. No, listen. Come back here. I'm, I'm going to ask you very politely to go back where you came from. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, they're both in there now. They've got theirs in the ground, which is lovely. And I, I would like to do that with all of the other ones. My concern is that as soon as I go in there and I attempt that, they're going to make a break for it. This guy's... I can't do it with this guy's. It's sand. What do I do? 